21 years. Did you oh, think man. when you yes. started that you, 21 years later, would still be at the top of your game and not only at the top of your game, having produced artists that are at the top of their game? Um, no, man, I didn't think. Um, <laughs> and especially right at the beginning, um, when I won that um, competition in Johannesburg in the year 2000, I was just there as a youngster, excited to be playing for 10,000 people. And boom, I won. And that's when my career as a DJ really kicked off. And then from there, it was all about, you know, I have to move to Joburg. And I decided to stay in Devon and make things happen in Devon. Yeah. You, well, you, you guys have truly made a serious mark in Durban. We've seen Devon's finest coming in and rocking the streets. And I remember I was in varsity at the time. And I, I mean, what a journey it's been in terms of, obviously, your progress in the music industry and growing that Durban brand that you've always spoken about. Um, yeah, man, it's been an amazing journey. I mean, uh, from obviously uh, teaming up with DJ Sox uh, to form Devon's finest, to studying just rocking club, then making Deben happen. And after that, studying the record uh, label Afrotainment and signing artists DJ Sindo, DJ Fisherman, Big Nas, and the rest, man. I mean, after, I mean, uh, 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 Afrotainment is in fact celebrating 15 years, yeah. and I'm celebrating 21 years, and I'm still here. So it's, it's really nice. But Ram, one of the things I love about you is, and you touched on it earlier, is that you made a concerted effort to stay in Durban and grow the industry in Durban to the point where now artists and musicians from Durban have a platform and have a place where they can build their career.